let's continue the story, shall we? Let us continue our story, shall we? With our adventure lost and starving in the between lands, he questions his own survival. Will he ever find the evil spirit who destroyed his factory? some food like now <gasps> yo that looks different that looks completely different than what i've been seeing what the hell one more hit i watch out i, I kind of i want to go in the water but can never be too careful all right oh oh shit this is much <laughs> i'm feeling healthy after that so we're back at our normal you're gonna hear noises in the background like that right there i can't help it people are doing construction at my house right now and uh, so I made a little house, speak about house, I made a little hut here, and I figured a way to get rid of our decay, and it's this beautiful tree all along, it's called a sap tree. You break the logs, guess what drops from it? Sap. Uh, let's just type that in, sap. Now you can use the sap to make uh, sap jello, but I don't know where to get the sludge jello from, the sludge ball. You know, I was guessing the the sludges themselves, if we can spot one anymore, are we on peace? Uh, the sludges themselves but I don't see any damn sludges anywhere so no clue but I got the animator back here still don't know what it does uh, we got some beautiful flowers nookweeds but most importantly I've been farming the uh, hags swamp hags to get these slimy bones because what's that this sapphire we can make some goodies out of this and I mean it's not tremendously better but we can make armor Sounds like a car is speeding up, if I'm being honest here. There's also this right here. Stone, not stone sword. A slimy bone sword, which is five attack damage. What about, so I didn't mind this ore right here. I have sulfur, which is like the uh, coal equivalent. Wait a minute. There's a sulfur symbol in here. When's if I put sulfur in here? What does that look like? Ooh. I don't know what to put on the other side. We would have a sulfur. I have no clue. But I have this ore, octine ore, so we need to smelt it. I got my furnaces over here. So I'll throw that in there with some sulfur. And we will take this. Okay, so. Uh, what else do we have in here? Do we have anything that's useful to us? Take a weed wood stick. Uh, Alright, so octine. Now this is what I wanted to see if this was better or not. Okay, four damage attack damage on pickaxe might be better than our pickaxe. Uh, purifier, interesting. Where's the sword? Alright, sword is six attack damage. Don't I do six? <laughs> I do 6.5 with this. Alright, you know what? I might stick to the stone sword because I put armor plating on the stone sword. And look at this, this bronze plating. It gives it 1.5 extra damage, so that's 6.5. That's one more than octane, but I might end up making octane armor. But for now, we need. We'll make a pair of pants out of this. How's that look? That looks nice. And I guess we'll make a pair of boots and we'll just, uh, we'll, we'll just use the rest for, just, I don't know, we'll just keep the rest. Now, there's something else I want to do. Uh, I looked up this recipe and if we go like this, we make string and now we can make a bow, which is why I've been gathering up stuff to make angler. Why don't I always do that? I'm retarded. What, what the? Pick it up. There you go. All right. Bam. We got the weed wood bow. So let's put that in five. Woo. That's a nice looking bow. All right. Let's take the octine out. And we will now turn this into a sword. Just because. That's not how you do it. That's not how you do it. Uh, weed wood. Weed wood. Oops. Bam. Good as new. So we'll do this. Uh, do I need any more food? I guess I can make uh, more food. But we are going to need to cut down this sap tree, so I'll go ahead and make a axe. Is this not how it's done? Oh, i got to cook it up first. Uh, I guess I'll throw it in here and cook it up. So, we need an axe. So I'll do that. And uh, we use this to cut down 
some sap just to make sure we got all this extra food we need looks what looks look what happens when we put the torch it just dies out instantly you got to make a uh, sulfur torches because those torches won't work i'm trying to look some else don't I have more food there it is okay so what else is in here that's it so uh i'll take oh no let's just go cut down some some of the sap tree shall we dun, 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 dun. Silk. So I cut down a good bit of it already. Hello? What the? Wait a minute. Was that always there? What the fuck is that? It's like creeper faces. It looks like you're like snails and stuff. That's disgusting. But look, as you see, we're gonna check that out. Hold up. I really wanna check that out. I'm kinda interested now. We're gonna cut down this uh, ball of sap. That's my favorite noise. And uh, we're gonna get a bunch of sap from it. And this sap will obviously allow us to re. Finish our DK bar. There's a Myron snail in here somewhere. Myron snails are the non hostile ones. Jesus Christ, that's really loud. Oh my god, I might have to jump cut here. <laughs> Let's see if we can gather up a bit. They're working on like piping systems right now. But, uh, alright. Um, who goes there? What was that noise? I keep on hearing like. <coughs> if you guys can understand what that noise is. No, I stopped the recording to wait for the sound to pass and hit recording and then it's back. But let's check out what's uh show for the algae. Show for the algae. Sounds like grass. Alright, this place seems kind of uh overgrown if you know what I'm saying. There's a whole lot of moss and shit in here. Let's see if we can get a peek of uh what's... Excuse me? Uh oh. I've been spotted! Compromised! Who's in here? Temple Guardian! Oh, I fucked him up. It's so loud. What the hell? That's one down. All right, let's break on open. Let's see what, what these guys got going on in here. What you got to say? What you got to say? That's easy work if I've ever seen any. You're next. Oh shit! Take out the boat. Oh my god, that's so cool. It's such a cool animation. I feel bad for doing this. I'm very sorry for it. Oh, we got kind of close. Let's see how much damage it did. do some damage. Was that it? Man, that was easy. There's all this. This is, looks really cool. This uh, temple block. That was awesome. What's this? This is dirt? Mud? That looks cool too. Alright. Interesting little temple we got going on. But, uh, what's. Uh, what? Did you guys see that? Hello? Wait a minute. Boy, do I see you right there? That's one of the evil spirits I'm looking for. That's the motherfucker who destroyed my goddamn fucking crack factory. You fucking piece of shit. Ah, oh shit. He like blurred my vision. Not really. He like turned me around. You fucking dead. Stop throwing shit at me. I can't tell if he's throwing shit at me or what. You're the easiest motherfucker. You're just a pushover. Okay, you know what? Actually. Take some cover in the bush. I don't know if I'm hitting him. Okay, I am hitting him. Watch where he throwing rocks at me, huh? I'm coming in there for the killing blow. For the killing blow. Oh. <laughs> what was that noise I made? He actually dropped something. He dropped, uh, I'll take this. Troll Smasher. That's my favorite noise yet again. Troll Smasher. What is it? I don't know. It doesn't even have a recipe. And he dropped, like, a block, uh... Oh, right here. What the? Piece of the past? What's that supposed to mean? I don't even know what that means, but... I think... I think we're pretty much done with this. To be honest, guys. There's like... We did all the little deeds that need to be done, and then we ended up finishing the big task overall, and that was to find a motherfucker who helped destroy my factory. I feel like it's pretty much over now here in the between lands. It's about time we said bye to the beautiful swamp lands of uh, the between lands. So let's get on out of here. But hey, that was a good adventure because uh, this not only gave us some new tools we can use on other bosses and stuff we come into in the future. Any dangerous mobs or traps we have to go against, you know, we'll have this extra equipment until we get even better equipment. But now i think that's gonna end off this episode this was a very nice 
place we ventured to. And I think I'm gonna put this piece of the past away for now. At least until something comes up where I really need to use it. But I might put it somewhere special. But for now, we'll retire that and I guess I can put that up there. <laughs> it's gonna despawn, but maybe I'll put good use to that too. <laughs>